is going on guys welcome back to another video and in this tutorial i'm going to be showing you guys how to create this digital text and logo reveal animation using filmora 12. this is so simple to make so let's jump into filmora and get started okay first thing first add your text or logo to the timeline then we need to add a solid layer so here i select this white solid and add it to the timeline then we need to add the shape mask effect so i search the effect mask in the effects tab then add it to the solid layer then go to the effects settings create keyframes on height and width then change both values to zero then go to the end and change both values to something 250 okay now it looks like this After that we need to change this shape layer to the alpha channel, so go to the new blue FX, select elements, then select alpha processor, then add it to the solid layer. This effect helps to change our layers to alpha channels. So now go to the effects settings, change the preset mode to reset to none, then enable invert mode. So now we need to change some settings here. So I change the growing value to 30 and the blur value to 60. Okay, now it looks like this. So now we need to create a pixel look, so go to the new blue FX, select Essential, then select Pixelator, and add it to our solid layer. Then go to the effects settings, change width and height values to 100, then change the block size to 30, and make sure to center the effect. Okay, now it looks like this. So now we need to export this project. After that, we need to create this digital line look. For that, I add an adjustment layer to the timeline. After that, add the effect called chalk edges. Then add it to this adjustment layer. Then you can change the line color you want. After that I like to add some glow to this, so here I add the BCC plus glow effects for this. Then go to the effects settings and change the brightness value to something 600. Okay now we need to duplicate this layer. And drag it to 5 frames forward like this. Then change the blend mode to lighten and you can change the edge color if you like. After that we need to add our exported video. So let's add it to the timeline. Okay, then change the blend mode to lighten. And drag this layer to 7 frames forward like this. Okay, now you can see these glow lines here. It's kind of weird. So go to the animation endpoint, create a keyframe on this brightness, then go a few seconds forward, and change it to zero. So I do the same thing for this layer too. Also need to change the opacity on our original logo layer too. So guys our animation is done, here's the result. So that's pretty much it guys, thanks for watching this tutorial, I hope you enjoy this, and please leave a like this video and be sure to subscribe to my channel, and leave a comment about this video, and what tutorial you like next, so let's meet up the next video, take care and peace.